Makes it about a five-year-old here. Yeah, I know you do a lot with uh, aging them with the scales and stuff. Right. So if anybody knows, yeah. I'll just drop them back in. Coming up the river cuts. <laughs> Fish on. Oh, nice. Very nice. Right where he's supposed to be. Come on, baby. Hang on. That fish was right in that slap water. That's a nice one. Are you ready? Yeah. Very good. Another five or six year old. I was going to say, they're looking around the same size, but I'm seeing identifying marks. The other ones had some black scales on the bottom. That one has a stripe on the side. So we know they're not the same fish. That's right. That's right. <laughs> All about the same size, but obviously different fish. <laughs> okay, put him back. Go. Got one. There we go. him follow it up and almost missed him so I paused for a second as soon as it started to drop he jumped on I love the jumping that they got going on. So full of energy. I'll tell you what, for mid-November, we are just hammering these fish in one 
little, I'll say, 30 foot hole. Yeah. I mean, that's six fish out of 30 foot hole. And I bet you there's a lot more in there. Look at those bright, bright <laughs> orange eyes. Ain't that cool? Look at that. Okay, we'll let this one go. Oh. Another one already? Yeah. There you go. A little heftier. He's got a bit more girth to him, yeah. You can tell they're bulking up. You know that cold weather's coming. Nice fish. Oh, probably 14 inches. Very nice. This one's looking a little bigger, huh? At least it's oh, fighting yeah, harder. Good attitude. <laughs> Small mouth has good attitude. Yeah. Yeah. A little bigger, a little better. A little heavier. We're upgrading, yep. little by little. Yeah, they're waiting for that stuff getting washed down, but don't want to work too hard for it. Oh, that was a perfect jump. Oh, he's got hyper pigmented. Melanoma on I me. Mean. Huh. That's what those dots are, spots. Hyperpigmented melanoma. They come mostly in the cold water. And uh, most of them will go away in the warm water. Doesn't hurt. Now another small. I call them clickers. Just another just bring it in. Yep. All right, let's see if we can maybe get one on the baby rod. <laughs> little fish, little rod. Should have a heavier jig on there. Look at those three young eagles up there. Yeah. I'm gonna check out to see if the new iPhone 11 or 12s, one of them has got a big soup lens on it. Yeah, I don't know uh, anything about the 12, but my friend has the 11 something or other and uh that's what he shoots most of his videos with is uh just the iphone i've got the eight which takes really good pictures yeah but it's only got maybe a two power zoom yeah and uh, i can't take my wildlife pictures so that's the thing with the gopro i love it for what it is oh did i just get one on the baby rod <laughs> that is a nice fish. <laughs> Way to go. Ooh. <laughs> he's he's pulling. <laughs> yeah, you got a nice fish on that rod. Can't exactly boat flip him with uh, this thing. I got to hand grab it. Nice fish. 
<laughs> well, hey. I think that might be the best of the day so far. So far, yes it is. He's almost as big as the rod. <laughs> <laughs> Let's let him go. It's funny how they hold on to your thumb a lot of times. You know, and they bite down. Yeah. I give that as a sign to just give them a second, you know? Once they let go, that's when they're ready, you know? I know for snook that's the case. When we're down fishing for snook in Florida, when you go to release them, you stick your thumb in their mouth and they bite down. And you let go and just let them hold on to your thumb. And you move them back and forth a bit. And as soon as they're ready, they let go with their mouth and swim off. It's really cool. I'm gonna go back to the bigger rod. <laughs> it's a little easier to set that hook. <laughs> I would say. After missing three, uh, it's time to go back to my size. <laughs> Yeah, you were just saying, we, we just caught 10 fish in this 50 foot stretch. That's, that's not bad at all. Especially this time of year. Yeah, mid-November. Mid-November. Just had some rain, have a front coming. And it's calm right now, but every now and then that wind comes up that river and just chills you to the bone. Uh, seems like I spoke too soon. <laughs> I would kind of like to get a hold of a walleye. I wouldn't mind it either. I really like the, uh, toothy critters yeah. when I was in Connecticut pike was uh, what I would target most of the time have a lot of fun with them we had some good ones down by oh there we go look at that water walker oh, oh yeah. and see this isn't like one of those TV show ones where you can tell I'm pulling them across because you can see from there. He has got some energy. I guess nobody's told them that they're supposed to be slowing down. Right. They haven't gotten the memo. Oh, it, yeah, easily. I mean, I, I think about how many times you're seeing the fish on the uh, transducer, what have you, and not getting them. So, for, yeah, for us to be getting them like every other cast, every third cast, it's uh, th they've got to be stacked up in there. Oh, there we go. What did I say? Every other cast. That was the second one. You know what? I think I'm going to take off the chest mount and just 
put it up and let it record non-stop because uh, it's almost to the point where we're spending so much time showing off these little ones it's interrupting our fishing <laughs> Let me get this camera on a pole real quick.
All right, let's try that little rod again. <laughs> we got baby fish. Might as well get them on a baby rod. So many, so many of these fish were getting a little boring. <laughs> That's number thirty-five. Not bad. We've only been out a couple hours. Right. <laughs> I don't think we've gone a hundred yards. Yeah, I was gonna say we started right there, right? Yeah. <laughs> so we drifted from there to here. <laughs> Oh, this is getting really boring. <laughs> Too many fish. Too many. It's funny seeing all the different color variations in them. You know, yeah, this one's pretty plain, but we've had so many that are just so bright, yeah. so many with like dark lines and... I think it's just a camouflage thing. Yeah. Smallies are just definitely a beautiful fish. They have so many unique characteristics between each one. the rains come and everything, usually in June, traditionally. And you get the mud, and then they're just blah. Yeah. Well, they're a tan, you might say. <laughs> Yet another. Nice bend to it. Oh, fiddle part. Got the quick release. We'll get back on them. <laughs> Not a lot of fish, but I hate to lose them that big. Yeah. It was a good size. That had some nice bend to it. And it's just like you said. You said we're going to come right down to this spot, yeah. get a couple bigger ones. We could have spent all day up there and got close to 100 fish. Oh yeah, no doubt. We definitely could have just kept putting them in the boat every couple of casts. But like like you were saying, it doesn't hurt to get some big ones too. Another nice one. Oh yeah. Alright, hold on one second. I'm coming <laughs> over to you. This one might control the thing, right?
Oh, I said, uh, this is why we moved out of that spot. To get the bigger ones. The little ones were fun, but the big ones are even more fun. Yeah, that's a good size. All right. I'll see that one. I was going to say, I think he's looking like the heftiest of the day. He's got the hyperpigmented melanosis on him. Yeah. Whoa, come back. I was going to say, you want me to get the net? Daddy might be a little happier if I don't try to flip it in. Yeah. I say your rods have definitely been doing the job. Very nice. <laughs> kind of a pretty fish with the dots on him. And I was gonna say, and you were saying before that with that hyperpigmentation. What is that? The hypermelanoma? Yep, hyperpigmented melanoma. Okay. Happens a lot in cold water. Interesting. Just another fish. Just another fish. Man, it's getting boring. <laughs> <laughs> Can we do something besides catch fish? <laughs> As my son would say at this point, Dad, it's just another fish. <laughs> This is the yeah, first awesome. fish ever caught on the Nico Leach. This is the, uh, oh man, he is active too. This is the flick shot. Gotta get a couple pictures. Oh yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> you only live with the mustache. Thank <laughs> you.